Okay, this is part two of the Grumman video series, how to lay out and teardrop in Google SketchUp. We're going to be doing the door on the shelving. So we'll start. The door's five inches from the bottom. Uh, we need to put the profile on the back, um, the line. So put that there, zoom back in. And then going from the back, center of the door is 79 inches, so click on that. Back of the door is 64 inches. And then the front of the door is 94 inches. So that will make a 30 inch door. So what we'll do is we'll just start up here. We'll draw some lines here, connecting the sides and the bottom of the door. Now this uh, is a radius top door, so uh, the radius, well, First off, we have to find the radius point, uh, which is actually three inches from the bottom. And again, I had the circle that has a hundred uh, segments on it. So this is a 40 inch radius. So you just drag it in the direction you want and then hit 40 and enter. So that'll give you a 40 inch radius. So then at this point, you can delete the parts that you don't need. Uh, now I'll leave this center line because what we're going to be doing is laying out the the window. Uh, so I'll come up to where I roughly want the top of the window, which is somewhere around in here. Now this window, uh, I chose to put a 15 by 18 window on here. This is a window that uh, little or Grant sells with Little Bear trailers and. So anyway, it's a 15 by 18 window. So that's my 15 by 18 square. I'll go ahead and uh, draw my square on there. And now that's the window. Again, go back up here, delete guides. And now what we'll do is start laying out, uh, or we'll uh, do the inner and outer skin. So if you hit the hold down the shift key as you select on the different edges of the outside of the profile. Now I've got the whole outside selected. What you do is use the offset tool, which is this tool right here. Click on that. You click anywhere on the blue part, click it, and drag it forward. And you'll see it creates another line. You can go either on the outside or the inside. And here I'm choosing to go in one and a half inches. So that creates my another line on the inside. So then what we'll do is we'll go ahead and lay out some guides for the floor. Now this is going to have a two inch frame and the side walls are going to set over the frame. So I'll go up two inches. That'll be the first part. And then on this floor it's going to be half inch plywood with a one by fours laying on their side. So that'll be an inch and a quarter up total. And then also you can come down a half an inch for that top thickness of plywood. Now what I'll do is I'll just click out here on this outside part, draw all the way over here. That creates, uh, and then just draw down and connect here. Now you don't have to worry about drawing outside the, the deals. We're going to go ahead and delete those. But let's zoom in here to where I can click on that other line. And then again, back and up here to the front. Okay, now that I got that, I can go ahead and delete these outside parts here that I don't need. Um, and this is going to come down actually the end right here. So this will be the floor will come all the way out. The outer skin would cover it. Okay, and then the same in the back here. Uh, we'll delete that. And so there we've got the floor laid out leave that part and go out to the and that's it uh, these are only five minute videos that I can record so we'll stop here and then we'll do the rest in more videos